Red Devil Football played their final home game of the season against the Newburyport Clippers on Thursday, November 10th, and they fought quite the battle. Burlington wins the coin toss, and it's time for kickoff. 11 minutes left in the first quarter, and number 9 of Newburyport catches the ball from the 25-yard line and scores the first touchdown of the evening, complete with extra point. They're already in the lead, but not for long, as our Burlington wide receiver, number 11, John Mello, catches the ball from the 45-yard line with the first Devil touchdown and the extra point to tie the game 7-7. Newburyport takes back the lead with one minute left on the clock, but the Devils tie the game once again in the second quarter. After a Burlington substitution, and with almost two minutes left in the first half, Burlington breaks that tie as wide receiver number one Gabe Santiago grabs the ball from the 10-yard line, and an extra point makes it 21-14 Devils. We're in the second half, and Newburyport revives the tie as they catch the ball from the 10-yard line with extra point and then takes back the lead 28-21. But Burlington refuses to stay behind with 10 minutes left in the final quarter as Red Devil wide receiver number 5, Jack Savaris, catches the ball from the 20-yard line and ties the game with extra point. While the Devils gave it everything they got, the Clippers score two more touchdowns, making the final score 42-28 Newburyport. The Red Devils will be tossing the pigskin one last time this season as they travel to Bedford High School on Thanksgiving morning, Thursday, November 24th, to take on the Bedford Buccaneers. This is John Vias for B News Sports.